Hey everyone and welcome back to another video um, and as you guys will probably know by my social media um, last Wednesday through to Friday I was in London with the amazing Emma Mumford who is now like one of my best friends um, and basically being bloggers and all we went to um, press events down in London we got invited to um, for something that's called Christmas in July um, and for you guys that don't know what that is basically Christmas in July is when all of your big brands like Tesco, John Lewis, any brands really launch all of their Christmas product range and they put on big massive press events um, for um, bloggers, anyone who's to do with press, so like newspaper editors, anything like that um, to attend to see their upcoming stuff um, whether that be to show their followers or to do Christmas wish lists or whatever it may be it's basically just get to get a sneak preview of what's to come um, so we went to lots of different events over um, two days on the third day we just did some shopping and I just basically thought it would be quite nice to show you guys what we got from each of these events um, everything that we got in these bags was free um, but it was just a real nice opportunity because I've never really been to any press events and it was a real nice opportunity to meet face to face with these companies and to meet face to face with people that I've maybe spoke to over email it was a bit bizarre um, especially putting faces to names but it was a really good experience we absolutely loved it and I think we're doing it again next year because it was just fantastic um, but these are press only events um, so I'll show you what we got from each place and um, some were like companies like John Lewis and things and others were like um, PR companies which obviously are an umbrella of lots of different companies and um, so we sort of this was on the um thursday we went to the john lewis event and we sort of gate crashed this because we weren't really invited as such but basically um one of the girls we bumped into these two bloggers and they were like oh there's a john lewis event just around the corner like they'll let you in there's not an issue just go and you know see if they'll let you in so they were like oh yeah no worries just come in and have a look around and i must admit the displays were like gorgeous loads of copper themed stuff and that seems like the big thing um for the christmas season and it was just an absolutely beautiful display i think i might do a sort of um i've been putting pictures of them on instagram i might do like a little video compiling all of my footage i didn't really vlog as such um but you never know i don't know i haven't in my mind up yet so we got these um socks like snowflake gray and white socks which look really cozy to wear with my winter boots i'm not sure what brand they are they don't have anything on them they might just be john lewis themselves um then we've got this lovely cute little um hush bracelet it's like a little star and it says um, Merry Christmas on the bottom but obviously once you take it off this card um, you could wear it all year round and it not look too Christmassy so it's got like a silver star on it and then we got I've got double these because Emma gave me hers because she doesn't like nutty chocolate and they've got nuts in them um, so we went to like there was a little stall um, and he had samples on I didn't realize you were going to get them in the goodie bag but um, it's this brand known as Simply Chocolate um, and he gave us like a couple of samples so this one's called Grainy Sue and this is peanuts, oats, caramel and dark chocolate um, and he gave us three of those and then he gave me a Grainy Billy which is coconut, cranberries and dark chocolate like little mini samples and then in the actual goodie bags um, you got three bars I think it was so you've got a Granny Sue, which is the Oaty one, which is, looks like this. You've got a Dark Marcy, which is um, marzipan and dark chocolate. That one. And then you've got a Salty Fred, which sounds gorgeous. It's dark chocolate and almonds. And this sounds really yummy. And you've got this one. So that was everything from the... Um, John Lewis event but that was a really cute goodie bag thank you John Lewis I appreciate it um, and we also went to a um, Bloom and Wild and Etsy event this isn't the Bloom and Wild bag because um, we had to condense everything um, but basically you went in they had loads of different um, stall holders that have shops on Etsy and they had a little Bloom and Wild store where you could make your own little flower jars so we got to take them home with me and luckily they actually managed to survive the trip back from London um, so you got three little jars and you got to make the bouquets of flowers yourself I've put pictures of these they're actually doing really well I've put pictures of these on my 
um, Instagram. I've got three. They're dying now, but they're not doing too bad considering they've come all the way back from London. By the way, guys, on the coach, which is what I took to get down to London, it's like a six hour journey for me. So for flowers to survive six hours, they've done pretty well. Um, so we got to make those ourselves and then they bundled them up for you. And then she also said to us, oh, um, as you go around, there'll be a like selection of mugs and you have to do a personality test and choose which then choose the mug that goes with your personality that you get at the end so like a little quiz um me and emma just really like the look of this one so we cheated a little bit and picked this one up and this is the um trend dodger you defy all fashions and walk your own path um and it's got hello sunshine written on it and it's got these watermelons and like watermelon lollies on it and i just thought it was really cute and i really liked it so we got we both got the same one we have actually got quite a similar style when it comes to things like that then we got some washi tape that's got like little sprinkly type things on it which comes in handy for like little crafts we got some um newton and apple pencils um which remind me of the um oh what are they called um happiness planner ones um, and the orange one says for illuminating ruminations for light bulb moments for bright ideas and for i can't even pronounce this word fluorescent flashes i think it says um and you just get four cute little pencils and i think they're quite a little cute gift then we got a little notebook which says which is pink and it's from thrift box and it says super secret evil plans which i thought was really funny and then we also, which we, we didn't realise until later on when we were sorting things out, we also got um, a £10 Etsy Christmas um, gift card as well, which is really cool. I'm not going to turn it around because it's got the cord on to use it. But yeah, £10 to spend on their website as well. So that was the Etsy one. Thank you, Etsy and Bloom and Wild. Really do appreciate that. Um, what have I got in this one? Is this the Crescent? No, this is Amazon. Again, my Amazon bag got a bit damaged, so I've had to just shot it in a bag. I've had to... So I've kept everything separate so I can show you which one each is from. This was the first event we went to and I nearly hit the floor with what we got in these goodie bags. Um, and at one point when I get to the item I'm talking about, Emma was like, Amber, you really need to put that away. We're in the middle of London, like put it back in your bag. Um, so I'll go through all the little bits first. So there's a Connect Space Shuffle 16 piece, like little build your own spaceship type thing which is great to put away for my cousins for Christmas. Um, then there is a Bayless and Harding Sweet Mandarin and Grapefruit Wash, um, Hand Wash. You probably won't be able to see the writing on it because it's reflecting, um, but this smells really, really lovely and I love the packaging because it makes it look really expensive. Yeah, it smells really nice. I'm gonna give these to my mum to pop around the house, so I'm really liking them. Um, then there was some Skin Iceland um, hydro cool firming eye gels which are a really nice thing to put on to sort of chill out you just put them under your eyes and it just like it makes you feel a little bit more refreshed um there was a little um this brain box give your memory a 10 second workout like little game um and there's like loads of different little questions in there and the sort of like just a little quiz for kids got that um i'm trying not to reveal the big item just yet <laughs> oh, what else have we got in here is that it oh hang on we got um these amazon christmas wish list um usb sticks which look like this i got every event we went to new enough we got a usb stick so we got one of those. Um, I got a um, DC Universe Lego Superman keychain, which again, good to put away for little stock and fillers for the kids in the family. Um, we got some Star Wars top trumps, which look like this. A Burt's Bees tinted lip balm, which just looks like this and it's very nude. I'm gonna give this to my mum. It's just like a sheer sort of look to it. Maybe take it on holiday with me, I haven't decided yet. So I got that. And then I got a lovely by Sarah Jessica Parker, um, just a little perfume sample. And last but not least, oh, is it the last thing? Is there one more thing? Oh no, it's a sitting out, it's fine. Um, this. What is this? <laughs> um, basically, we all got given 
Amazon Fire Tablets. I think these are maybe going to be the big thing for Amazon this year because last year people got, we were talking to people and they got the Fire Sticks. Um, and this is just a black um, Fire Tablet. It's the 8 gig 7 inch one um, and it's got cameras on the front and back. And I just think this is like, I don't know, like I just, I nearly cried and I was like, what? This is crazy. I rang my mum, told my mum, my mum was like, are you joking? Like, really? Um, and Emma was just like, Amber, put it back in your bag. Seriously, do you want someone to take it off you? Just put it away. So um, I got a bit overexcited by it, but anyway, like, who's not going to get overexcited by getting a tablet for free? Like, it's crazy. Um, so next we went to the Morrison's one. Um, the Morrison's event was really cute actually because they had like literally I felt like I was going to be rolling home because they had loads of like um, samples of the cakes and stuff that they're going to release for Christmas and they showed us all like the meats, all the different food, all their um, clothing, basically everything and um, the alcohol, they did us mocktails which were absolutely lush. Um, so in this goodie bag from Morrison's you obviously get the canvas bag which is good because it's reusable. Not sure I'm going to be using it yet because it says Christmas on it. We got this little Morrison's Jingle Bell Star, which is really sweet. I think he's got a little bit squashed on the way, but I'll be able to... And it, I just think that's really sweet. We got... My mum was like, this is mine. A bottle of um, Prosecco, um, an Italian Prosecco. So my mum's going to be jumping into that one. Um, there was a... Um, Morrison's tea light candle holder like a bark one but this is a um, very autumnal so I feel like you can use this all year round and not just at Christmas then we got some mini panettones which have got really squashed like um, milk chocolate panettones <laughs> and last but not least we got some macaroons in all different colours and flavours which have got sparkles on them and are yummy because I tried them at the actual event so that was did we get anything else in the Morrison's one? Oh, and my badge. I kept my badge because when we walked in, they put me down as Amber Howe Coupon Queen and then Emma had Coupon Queen on it and we having this argument about the fact that I was going to trademark Coupon Queen but she's already trademarked it. Like, we were joking, obviously. Um, But instead of just being Amber Howe Blogger, it's Amber Howe Coupon Queen. So, hey-ho. Um, so that was that. I've got three more bags to go through. I'll do the Tesco one. Next, again, a nice little canvasy bag to keep. These were a nightmare to carry around London, by the way. My arms were absolutely breaking. Um, so we got some luxury charity Christmas cards with gorgeous glittery reindeers on the front. I'm sorry if anyone's going to ask me the prices of this stuff because it will be in stores. I don't know um, because we didn't get given the price list. Um, then we got this bauble, which actually matches. I noticed when Emma was doing her video, it actually matches the Christmas cards and it's got 2016 written on it and it's a gorgeous bauble. I'll see if I can open it and take it out and show you. Because Emma took hers out of her box. And it's this. Look at that. How cute. Yeah, so we got that. Then we got a white grace evening bag, which has got a order toilet and um evening bag and a lip gloss in it and it just shows you that right on the front there so a little lipstick little roll on um an order to toilet um, and a little clutchy clutch bag and another panettone <laughs> I'm not in the mood for eating panettone at the moment because it's not Christmas yet. Um, and then we got this really jazzy Tesco wooden US. I was I was amazed at this. It's a one gig um, memory stick. So we got that. And all of this was free, like which is crazy. And then we went to this is a. Um, PR company. This is a PR company called Popcorn PR and um, they obviously have Panasonic in their PR like branch so we got this Panasonic bag Um I actually got quite a lot from these. We got some um, black cherries which is a bit random but I think this um, OP's brand must be part of their um, umbrella of brands basically. I apologise about the phone ringing. Um, and then we got some mince pies. Again, it's way too early for these, but hey, um, these are spiced orange walkers, um, spiced orange cranberry and that's it, isn't it? Spiced orange and cranberry mince pies from walkers. The four knock me off track. We got those. 
and then I got some chocolate I think it, oh no it wasn't it was a luxury shortbread selection from Walkers and these are like loads of different shortbreads and I am loving like I love shortbread and my sister will probably be in there for those ones then we got this really cute Walkers tin of shortbread <laughs> again um and he's got little packs of shortbread in his head oh, I don't know how I managed to carry all this home literally Emma had to buy another case we had that much stuff it was crazy then um I think Emma might have got these but she gave me them because she didn't want them and these are the miniature mince pies so just little mini, mini mince pies by Walkers again um then we got these um proper pops zesty lemon and fiery chili little pop chips in a little carton sounds quite interesting because i've never heard of them before um, and they look quite yummy and then i've got a massive selection they're basically on the way out i also got a muddle and mash strawberry daiquiri mixer which i drank at the weekend but basically on their way out um they had like a pot and you could just put your hands in and take perfume samples so i've just got a massive mixture there's viva la juicy by juicy couture mark jacobs elizabeth arden um paco raban and diesel and ck two into you like just got loads of them because i put them on my clutch bag for nights out um, and last but not least, we got two. I've never tried this, but Emma, this is Emma's favourite apparently. It's the OGX um, shampoos. We got the coconut water one um, and the biotin and collagen one, which sounds good for my hair because it sounds like it's good for rebuilding. So we got those. And then last event was, hang on a minute, what are they called? Crescendo PR which again have lots of different brands under their little branch. Sorry, I've just got the Leo, pick them up. Um, we got these um, Oasis Floral Celebration Crackers. Basically the lady was saying they're a living cracker. So at Christmas you make your floral decoration inside the cracker um, and yeah, like on the back and it becomes like a table centerpiece. So Emma couldn't fit hers in her box, so I ended up with two of those to take home. They weren't in the goodie bag. We actually asked, had to ask for those. Um, and then we got another one of the Bayless and because the Bayless and Harden are actually part of the Popcorn PR. So, sorry, not Popcorn, Crescendo PR. Um, so we got another one of their soaps, which is the same one that was in the Amazon bag. We got a little Lego Friends, like bowling type little girls one. There was a Lego um, Bright Bricks Reindeer and I'm going to give these to one of the girls at work who's got a little girl. Um, there was some Oti's Christmas tea bags. There's Christmas Delight tea, Christmas Cookie tea and Santa's Little Helper. There was this gorgeous um, Have Yourself a Merry Christmas slate um, little tag which was lovely. don't want to drop that on the floor. I got a Lego City um, car and I'm going to give this to my cousin for Christmas. A infru Infrutation Sport, one of those fruity water bottles where you can put the fruit in the middle. And I got, we also got a um, sports bottle handle grip to go with it and a um, recipe book as well. That was it. Oh no. And we got um, more memory sticks. Um, we got a Dobby's one, which has got all their flowers and things on it, and the Crescendo one itself. I think these have, I think, if I, I might be wrong, but I'm sure with all of these, if we actually plug them in, they've got pictures from the events in case we want to post them. Um, but that was that little lot of goodies. Um, so basically, as you can see, I've done amazingly well and i just want to say a huge thank you to all the brands there was one little last thing that i wanted to show you and i totally forgot to show you it with the morrison's thing i've just spied it on the windowsill we went to morrison's at the morrison's event they had loads of like little activities and one of them was if you posted a photo and put hashtag morrison's christmas or something um they printed out a polaroid so i've just got a couple of these i wanted to show you of me and emma um because i really love these and they're really good memories and the guy that was there i'm just going to cover his instagram because he might not want you to go and stalk him <laughs> um he went oh look i've printed you another one out and he, you can't see it on the photo but he actually made us the center of the reef on the whole of the thing um so yeah i've just got these lovely little memories to put in my bedroom and hopefully put in a frame 
But I just want to say a huge thanks to all the brands. Emma, I love you, girl, and we're going to have to do it again. Like, amazing time. Great meeting you. And you are literally my soulmate as a friend. Seriously, like, love you. Um, and, yeah, and I've also got a London haul video to do because, of course, when in London, you have to shop. Um, and I've got plenty more pictures to be posted on Instagram, but please like, subscribe. If you are a blogger or if you have any questions about any of these events or if there's anything that I've missed out that you think I should have said, just leave your comments below. I will try get, to get back to everyone and go check out all my other social media links. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.